Uh, dearest member of uh, class 3F, distinguished Professor Patricia Forte, I'm so happy to know that uh, your class and you accepted the idea to adopt the righteous and that your choice uh, was connected with me. I'm not only so proud, I'm very happy to have such a wonderful class who will think and work to discover life of somebody who dedicated a life to development of civil society of Bosnia and Herzegovina and the West Balkan region. I'm very, very sad that my obligations will not allow me to come and join your play, which will uh, uh, be organized in Tulane uh, Library on um, March 4th this year, but uh, I know that I will be with you uh, in my heart this day. I hope that you will film, as I film my addressing to you, that you will film your play and that I will have a possibility to look at it later on. Well, what to say in front of such a wonderful class? I think that the most important is to stress that uh, righteous people, people who made their choice, give you a chance to think about possibility of choice. You can always stay human being in the worst of circumstances or you can choose to become inhuman in inhuman circumstances. It is the shortest about righteous who act during the war period. But something which I want to tell you is that there is not only about war when we are thinking and talking about righteous. In the society in which uh, corruption is from the top to the bottom of the society or in the society where politicians or uh, clergy representatives or any other authorities abuse their power for the sake of their own purposes, neglecting or violating the laws and human rights of other people, uh, I'm sure that young people have a lot of mm, things to do. So it means that um, we are all uh, responsible to our own societies, that we are all uh, have a capacity to show our civil courage. It only depends on each of us individually. That's why I think that righteous people from the war periods all around the world are very important uh, as uh, role models for you, for young generations, even for the future gen generations, generations of your kids. Uh, if, we will, if you will not have a uh, chance to think about righteous people from the past, I'm pretty sure that you will not have a chance to think about your future. That's why think about your role in your society. Think about how those righteous people can inspire you in the moment when you faced something which is unfair, which is immoral, which is not according to your moral norms. How can you use your civil courage to disobey, to oppose, to resist to every single uh, person or group who violate laws and who have a chance even to punish you because of your resistance? But please, Think always about that you have a chance to resist or to stay as a quiet uh, grey mass which do nothing. I'm sure that all of you from wonderful class 3F will always use your choice and I will be always with you.